Hey everybody. I have that drowned rat look going on because I just got a shower. Um, it's Friday morning. Yesterday I did not vlog, as you all saw. I did not feel very good yesterday. I felt blah. And I, you know, women will get this, I have the cramps. And so, um, stuck around the house. I stayed in my pajamas all day. I didn't even, I did a little tiny bit of paperwork. I got like four things ready to go into the mail, but I didn't really do any. My cousin's coming over here in a little bit. We're going to go over paperwork and then I'll actually do all of it on Sunday because tomorrow I have a wedding to go to. So, um, I don't even know what the hell I'm saying right now. It's like 10 o'clock in the morning. I just, you know, like I said, just got a shower. I'm getting ready to do a little checkbook work for the business. I got all my um, south tube footage moved from this computer to that computer. So I'm going to render it on Movie Maker all on my laptop. I had well, quite a bit to do. I'm trying to get the ump to sit down and just do it. But I have not gotten that oomph yet, so who knows when that'll come. Tomorrow I'm going to be filming wedding stuff, and I have a bunch of stuff on my camera. Um, Ken did a, a day out with the Humper vlog, because him and Dad went out about one day, which is going to go on his channel. Oh, I know what I'm going to title this video. Are we or aren't we? I've been getting a lot of comments in private messages, comments on my page, comments on my videos. So, are you and Ken a couple? Are you dating? What, what, what's going on? <laughs> we are enjoying each other's company. And yes, we like each other, so. He's just fun to hang out with. When I know more, I will tell you. <laughs> I've actually known him. I met him six six years ago six years ago or seven years ago it's been a while that I've known him um what else do I have to share oh I was taking him home and we were down in Indiana by this time that my dad called and my dad calls and he goes is this iron here ours or Ken's Okay, backstory. Kenneth is obsessed with ironing his stuff. I mean, he irons his boxer shorts for God's sakes. And, um, he, I mean, I said, yo, yeah, that's his. I will tell him. And I hang up the phone. And I said, um, you left your iron at my house. And it looked like his puppy dog had ran away. He just, he could not believe it. He's like, man... I said, it's okay, uh, maybe I'll bring it back or something on my next day off, but um, I said, just put your clothes in the dryer really warm for a few minutes and the wrinkles will fall out and just put them on. So that's what he's going to try. Like that day when we I took him out to the botanical garden <laughs> and you know he's walking through the house and he goes, man, I need to iron my jeans, there's a few wrinkles. I'm like, dude, you're going outside to a botanical garden. I don't think the flowers are going to care if you have a couple wrinkles in your jeans. Look at mine. But yours look nice on you. I'm like, what the, come on. <laughs> He's funny with that ironing. I was proud he didn't iron for two days, which was very difficult for him. Alright, what else do I have to say? I really don't got a whole lot. Cool like that Asian Jason. I'm glad your fudge got there in relatively one hunk instead of a blob of nothingness. I was scared. I figured it was cooler here. It might get there fairly unharmed, but I didn't know what kind to send you. I had peanut butter chocolate or I had chocolate with nuts and I kept the chocolate with nuts here. I haven't opened it yet, but I have it. Alright. I am like brain freaking dead, people. 
I gotta go open up my bank software so I can check our checkbook stuff out. I'm also thrilling. Bye.